Hey guys, this is Gathaway here, and I'm doing a brand new series. I finished Resident Evil with Jill and Chris, so this is a spin-off game. It's on the catalog. I reckon I don't know how this game is. I already played a little bit with my friend Jazz Wax, but we don't know if we actually like it or not. So I'm gonna try to see if there is there is no online. The game is completely dead. So the experiment. Wait a minute. Tutorial. Let's do the tutorial first. Learn the basic knowledge we need to survive on the battlefield. Basic training. December 21st, 2015. Experiments have been designed to weed out of those who will not be no use to us. They most likely died during the training. Well, okay. Two, one. Ready. The jammer allows you to free from zombie perception if damaged zombies will attack you, target you. They will not target you if you attack them. Okay. Re relays information such as gunshots and footsteps to the player. Position will be put displayed at a solid triangle with the teammates at all triangle outlines. You have a mission. Coming back. Third. Look. In the head. It's pretty straightforward. That means I'm going to attack. The stage icon displays in your HP status and equipment to info your teammates. The icon will lose over your heads of your teammates. So, zombie rate of utility meter status online ID is zombie effective meter. I've never fight. That's allow you to communicate with your teammates. The icon is like the visible over your head to your teammates. Mm -hmm. I'm a grenade. Grenade out, bitch! Really? Wait a tutorial. It's an okay game, I guess. It's, it's pretty. It's pretty straightforward. Okay, guys. That's it. I'm gonna when I come back, we'll do the advanced training. So if you like this video, please comment, subscribe, like this video, and to help out. If you haven't already, I'm putting a post notifications, never miss another episode. And I'll see you guys next time. See ya.